In this tutorial, we'll show you how to get started with the 3D router foot controller and the Xbox adaptive controller so that you can play any Xbox game. Is it your first time with the 3D router or you haven't updated it for a while? Let's check for the update to make sure you can enjoy the latest features. To do so, you'll need 3D router's free software, the dashboard. In the box of the 3D router, you'll find a welcome card inviting you to visit the start page of our website. In your web browser, type in 3drudder.com slash start. When the web page appears, install the dashboard and update your 3D rudder. The Xbox Adaptive Controller has two USB ports. When you plug the 3D rudder in the right USB port, it takes the functionality of the right thumbstick of the traditional gamepad and becomes a foot-powered stick. Likewise, when you plug the 3D rudder in the left USB port, your 3D rudder takes the functionality of the left thumbstick of the traditional gamepad. Once plugged in, your 3D rudder is automatically enabled. It emits a beep, then three, then one. You can now put your feet on it and stay still until you hear. This beep meaning that the 3D rudder has detected your feet. To trigger action, just tilt the device forward, backward, left, and right with effortless movements of your legs. There are plenty of games you'll want to play. Let's see how it works with Steep by Ubisoft. Put your feet on the 3D rudder and wait for the beep. Let's go! Creating a new profile is very easy to do in the app. Select Configure, then New Profile. Enter a name and save. When you visit the stick menu, you can change several parameters. For example, you might want to change the default curve for a smooth one to create your own configuration. Turning on Copilot lets you add the traditional gamepad to your gaming configuration. In the app, select the button with the three dots and press to turn on Copilot. Press again to turn it off. The 3D router is also a great PC peripheral to play PC games, use Windows-based applications, and move in virtual reality. How to do it? Easy, just use the 3D router dashboard. With the dashboard, your 3D rudder can emulate a foot keyboard with up to eight key bindings, a foot joystick with up to four axes, a foot mouse with exactly the same functionalities as a hand mouse, and a VR motion controller.